We're here, guys. We made it. We did it, Joe. We did it, Joe. We made it to the Handsome Devil commentary. Is this going to make me understand the difference between rugby and football? Y'all, I cannot even tell you how long I have been wanting to make this video. It is ridiculous how long it is taking me to make this video, but I've had, I had such a busy month. Today is October 1st, so we're in the new month now, um, and I should be able to do some of the videos that I have been wanting to do for weeks. Um, so welcome to the start of a new series on my channel called Watching Nick Gallatin's Entire Filmography, which if you're new here, hi, I love Red, White, and Royal Blue. Um, I made two videos where I watch bad movies because the Red, White, and Royal Blue boys are in them where I watch Cinderella and Purple Hearts, which are two of Nick's most iconic pre-Red, White, and Royal Blue movies. But the man has quite the filmography. Quite the filmography. You know, it's a bit extensive. It's a bit iconic. Um, and, and I've been told since I made those videos to watch Handsome Devil, this old movie of Nick's that is apparently very good. Um, so I've been wanting to watch it for ages. Um, but I, I'm also just, he's in so many other things that I'm so curious about. So I thought, I'm like, if we're doing a couple of them, we might as well do all of them. So um, over the next however, However long we're going to be watching his entire filmography in preparation for Mary and George and the idea of you in in 2024 all right um I'm also very tempted to do a video reading the idea of you in preparation so if that sounds like a fun time and you think I should do that let me know so today we'll be watching handsome devil I have been meaning to do this for ages um sorry it's been a minute since I uploaded anything but I am working on a Halloween Horror Nights vlog because I was there for a week um I am working on a new podcast episode I know we've gotten questions about that so many things are happening all right happy fucking Halloween season what is happening hold on there's something happening everybody's screaming in my Instagram group chat Y'all want a live reaction of what's happening? <gasps> Hello? Jeremy Ray Taylor's engaged? Oh my, damn girl, be careful, he's pro-life. <laughs> Um, so I got a lot of really funny comments in my Red, White, and Royal Blue commentary video, um, because I'm, I'm a fidgeter and I was fidgeting with a Rapunzel doll and I got a lot of really funny comments about it. Um, and as a chronic doll collector, yes, y'all, as if y'all can see, I'm a doll girly, all right? Like, that's like my big special interest other than like Red, White, and Royal Blue and Donna Tart books and the works. Um, so I thought I would pick out a doll to play with in in my videos from now on because i just you know give give attention to some of my girlies um this is one that i just got for my birthday this this doll the she is me i am her all right this is a shadow high girly um her major is creative writing which was my major she's maroon which is my favorite color um i am i am obsessed with the fact that these dolls are like notoriously high fashion and a homegirl just showed up in a hoodie and leggings okay look at these acrylics what are you writing with that look at the look at the face card like why is she serving cunt to go sit in the library i don't, I don't get it like she this is so camp i am obsessed with her miss scarlet rose two shades of red that are not maroon um she's got her oh she dropped her starbucks cup I just fucking dropped it. She has a fucking Starbucks cup. She's holding her pen. And yeah, once again, like, what are you writing with those nails? I know you're not comfortable in those. To, also, like, Girly Pop, she came with, like, two, like, little paperback copies of this book. So, like, not her, like, repping the merch <laughs> while reading the book. Like, that is so me. Oh, she's so me. I'm obsessed with her right now. So she is, I, she is the first one that I am selecting to be my little doll accomplice in my video today. <laughs> Why is she serving cunt to go to Barnes & Noble and get her Starbucks? Like, she's so real for that. Also, guys, Bottoms commentary is coming. Do not fret. Do not panic. Bottoms commentary is coming. I love Bottoms. Okay, I've seen it six times, uh, five of which were in theaters. So it is my most watched movie in theaters ever. I'm literally dressing up as Britney for Halloween. Um, you can see a little, you can see a little hint of that back there. Um, and I'm determined to finish making the costume before I do the video so I can watch it in the video. But uh, the, the official Bottoms Twitter account liked my progress post. So, um, yeah, Bottoms is coming. Obviously, another Nick movie. 
don't worry. <laughs> don't worry. I'll probably, I'll be doing that sometime this month. Without further ado, I've been talking for long enough. Let's watch Handsome Devil. Um, I don't know anything about this movie other than that I know that it's gay, but I'm pretty sure the two main characters are not, like, a couple. Like, I think they're just, like, gay friends. <laughs> um, and I'm pretty sure they're lacrosse players. Okay, Alexander Claremont Diaz! All right. Um, I'm really excited. I've heard my friend Natalie, who was in one of my Red, White, and Roblox videos, she's watched this movie. She's a big old Nick fan. Um, and she loves this movie and has been recommending it to me. So let's fucking go. I'm so excited. Okay, so we're Irish. That red is fake as hell. Who did the dye job on that? Is this Dark Academia? Don't tell me this is Dark Academia. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start convulsing. Oh, I did not like that. <laughs> did not like that. <laughs> what was that? We're here, guys. We made it. We did it, Joe. We did it, Joe. We made it to the handsome devil commentary. <laughs> no, and the way that the, these two YouTubers that I've been obsessed with right now, um, a story worth telling, they cover, like, queer media. They made a video on this, and I have not watched it because I wanted, like, a true, fresh reaction to this movie, and that has been killing me because I, I watch all of their videos. So I think I could finally watch theirs after this. You should watch theirs after this, too. They did a great Red, White, Marrow, Blue video. I literally paid for their Patreon so I could watch their full uncut version. Um, yeah. I don't think this is Dark Academia, but, like, even academia in general really makes me giggle and kick my feet a little bit. Maybe the reason you have your own room is so nobody gets bombed, you know, in the middle of the night. And hello to you too, Weasel. Why is the professor wearing fucking Hogwarts robes right now? Is he a nun? Men aren't nuns. What am I saying? Oh, rugby, not lacrosse. Duh. It's the UK. They wouldn't be playing lacrosse. Is this gonna make me understand the difference between rugby and football? I'm sorry, like, y'all go to an, an all-boys school and you're shocked that Personally, there are boys that are gay. After a short illness, like, that just seems really, like, friend, that just seems absurd to me. Like, yeah, of course, like, statistically some of y'all are gonna be gay. I don't know what year the sixth place in, but, like, Which will maybe oh my god, is that fucking, is that fucking Lenny from Marvelous Mrs. Maisel? Oh my god, her acrylic is breaking. Oh my god, give her the hollow taco. It has been a long since the last. Oh my god. Hi. I really hate narration. I don't know if y'all know this about me. I hate narration. I hate it. That's the guy who changed everything. That's the guy who changed everything. Really? The hair the hair is taking me out. What year was this made? I don't even know. So I'm gonna assume it's just ambiguously 2000s. Alright. So let me guess. He's gonna be his roommate. And they were roommates. Oh, uh, uh, Nick Alex in the face actor that you are. No, we're already out here working overtime. Ah, I love this man. <laughs> that's, my, that's my favorite white boy. That's my favorite white boy. He's I'm getting him his Oscar. He's get I'm getting him as he's getting an Oscar one day and it's gonna be because of me. Because I'm 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 campaigning for it every day of my life. Can you oh <clears throat> That took me by surprise. What the fuck does that mean? Because he's <laughs> because what? Because he's hot? <laughs> Real. <laughs> That's the reason. That's real as hell. That is so real of him. Or is it just because he's a rugby lad? I'm gonna think that it's because he's hot. Oh, it's because he's on the rugby team. Okay. <laughs> I think my version is better. Oh. Homeboy has barely talked. How am I supposed to know if he has an Irish accent in this or not? Come on, Nikki, baby. Speak up. Like, can y'all not do this anywhere else? Like, you really have to do it in his dorm room? Oh my god! Do they really not get together? Because this is like perfect enemies to lovers, but they were roommates. Set up. I'm gonna be gagged. That's fucking funny. It's like you two can stalk your peers <laughs> if you learn how to read. Ooh, good choice. I'm so jealous. I never got to read good shit in my English classes. Like, the only things that I can remember really enjoying were Pride and Prejudice and um the importance of earnest is that what it's called the, that like really famous satire love that but like all these kids who got to read like boy in the striped pajamas great gatsby like i'm jealous as hell i'm jealous as hell because i got we, oh my god we got fucking Ernest hemingway and they called it a day and i was in like the most advanced english class and we didn't get anything fun is it rugby like soccer but you like hold the ball <laughs> i don't know sports guys full disclosure Never played a sport in my life. I was a theater kid, obviously. 
Oh, oh, oh. Why are, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are, this is not how you play rugby. I don't know rugby, but this is not how you play rugby. The way that Nick is once again out acting everybody. Like, oh, <laughs> Nick. Like, other than Red, White, and Royal Blue, I have yet to see a movie of his where he is not acting circles around everybody. Like, ah, uh, yeah, to be Nick Galatine. That's so real. I say other than Red, White, and Royal Blue because because everybody in Red, White, and Royal Blue was amazing. Um, he, he gagged, he ate, he served, obviously. You can hear me gushing about his performance in that movie in my commentary video for that. Um, but... <laughs> Okay. That is my worst nightmare. Why would you do that? Like, are you- you are setting this kid up to get bullied. Like, what do you mean? You're like, this essay was better than everyone else's? Come up here and read it! Like, that's insane. That's insane behavior. So we- so we are bullying children. Got it. Got it. We are bullying children. We are setting them up for embarrassment and failure. Why do you assume that this lesson isn't for you? I kind of gagged him there. Boy. Why are we throwing things? Why are we throwing things? This is gonna give me PTSD. This is gonna be give me PTSD to high school. My theater teacher threw stuff at us. Okay. <laughs> He's literally existing as a boy who plays rugby, and you're like. <laughs> Buddies. Oh my god, is that zip ties off? Oh my god! Oh. oh my god, are we gonna get Nick's zip? Yeah. Oh, oh. Why are all of these professors like a bit insane? <laughs> are they, aren't they in high school? What was that? Had that first drink, his night would have ended oh no! Don't say that. Aggressive tendencies, alcohol, daddy issues—not a good combo. <laughs> Closeted, probably. Ooh. <laughs> adults. Okay. What kind of adults? Gay adults. Totally. Just double check. Wait, did he see Connor go in there? Yeah. Oh shit. Okay, interesting. Wait, I have so I have so many questions. I have so many questions. What are we? No, no. Also, am I crazy or does he look like John Mayer? <laughs> they just sing. They just sing, "Dear John" at the top. Oh my god! Woulda, coulda, shoulda! The damn sure never would've danced with the handsome devil! <laughs> Bro, you're the one talking to him in the shower. That's a bit homosexual. Why is everybody so homophobic? Like, does this not take place in at least 2016 when this came out? Nothing's going on. Change is taking place. One week before the semi final of the senior cup, come on. Okay, Archie Andrew! <laughs> oh, okay. We're not doing this. We're not doing this. We're not doing this. No. Yeah, like your nickname is Weasel and you think you have the merit to speak on a ridiculous tomfoolery. Oh no. Then they'd apologize and everyone would be on my side for once. I will tell you he's gay, alright? Don't do this. Are you fucking for Masters is gay? No. No. There it is, folks. No. Oh yeah, if I were Connor, I'd never speak to your ass again. What was that? Are you fucking for real? Are you for real right now? I agree. I agree. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, if it isn't the consequences of my own actions. Oh, no. Okay, Mona Laga. Like you? Cause he's not. You're that oh my god! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
Ooh, good scene, good scene. Yes. Oh, he's so Teenage Dream by Olivia Rodrigo right now. Yeah. Ooh, that was a good scene. I liked that a lot. Ooh. Costume change. It's the day after. I'm so sorry. Connor's gone missing. <gasps> what? I have no cares about the fucking rugby, Walter. Real. <laughs> Some boys don't play rugby. Period. Brenda's gone missing. Today of all days, I know. On everything. Oh. Oh, no. You're playing for us. Oh. It's my team if you're playing oh. for us. Hey. How y'all doing? Hey. But you cannot fit into this team. Since when? Is it? Look at you, you're incompatible. Incompatible according to who? Us. King. King behavior. King behavior. Yep. You're doing too much. This coach is doing too much. Like, it's literally high school fucking rugby. That means you haven't known the triumphs and defeats, the epic highs and lows of high school football. You're up here? Like, I need you to take it down to here. Because... Cute. Cute, 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 cute. Yep. 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 This is their standing on the desk moment. <laughs> Aww. Stop. You don't get to clap for them. You don't get to clap for them. This is Arthur. Aww. 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 Why do I want to cry? No! We're good. We're fine. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. Nope. Nope. We're good. We're good. We're fine. Oh, that was sweet. Okay. Alrighty, so something that I decided that I wanted to do as we watch these movies is that I wanted to rank them all. It's been a minute since I've done a tier list on this channel. I used to do them all the time, um, but I thought it would be really fun to rank them all as we go through them. Um, and so we would rank the couple that we've already watched and then rank this one. Um, that was really cute. Um, so like, I wasn't like sold on it at first, but like it got me. It did. I really like the idea of like, a queer movie that's not about romance at all. Like, I think that that's super interesting, like, having it just as, a, like, being about, like, queer identity, and it's not about, like, the the inherent sexuality of it all. I think that that's, like, really nice as just more so, like, a story about, like, societal pressures and just, like, your identity and, like, you know, as a young person and, like, yeah, like, super wholesome and sweet. So just, you know, a lot of media like this in general, especially, like, young, like, coming-of-age stuff, um, especially with, like, queer cinema, it's, like, there's always, like, a romantic subplot, and, like, there wasn't one in this, and, like, that's just, that's kind of wild. Um, it was, very, yeah, very Dead Poet Society, which I don't love Dead Poet, I don't love Dead Poet Society, if y'all have seen my big Dark Academia video, um, not a fan of Dead Poet Society, but, like, it gave me those sort of vibes matched with, like, Perks of Being a Wallflower, like, sort of, like, coming-of-age teen movie, so, which, love Perks of Being a Wallflower. So, let me go through my categories here. <laughs> so, top tier, we have Film of the Century. There are two movies that I know are gonna be in this and then we'll see if anything else surprises me um invented acting all right so like not necessarily film of the century but like nikki baby was acting circles around everybody um middle tier probably wouldn't watch this if he wasn't in it like i feel like this could inherently apply to most of these movies but they're probably going to fall in either the lower or upper tiers um got looked pretty at least so like not too great but he looked good. Um, and then it's going to be a no from me as the bottom tier. So let's go ahead and rank the ones that we've already seen. Obviously, Red, White, and Royal Blue is going in Film of the Century. Like, I don't need to explain myself with that one. Um, then we, okay, so Cinderella, we're going to put in Looked Pretty, at least. Bad movie. But he looked good. He sang his little songs. And, yep, 
Exactly. Um, Purple Hearts is gonna be a no from me. That was a hard one to get through, and I would not wish that upon my worst enemy. Um, and then rounding us out with Handsome Devil here today, I'm gonna put it in Invented Acting. King was acting. All right, King is always acting, but like, yeah, he was really good. Um, and I liked that movie. I would recommend it. Like, it's not film of the century, but he invented acting. Right. We have, so we have eight. We have eight to go. Oh, how exciting! Um, a couple of these will probably be merged into one video, but some of like I'm sure High Strong and The Beat Beneath My Feet are going to be their own video. Obviously, Bottoms is going to be its own video. Um, but a couple of the others might be merged together. Um, so oh, how fun! Stay tuned for the Nick Galaxy Cinematic Universe. I'm very excited. I hope you're excited. Um, link in the description for all the things that you can need. Like I said, there's a new podcast episode coming out soon, and I have some other stuff I've been working on. Um, watch the other Red, White, and Royal Blue videos if you're, if you're here for that and want to have a good time. Um, yeah, comment, like, and subscribe, press the notification bell, because I don't have an uploading schedule, but I'm trying to upload more frequently. Life is crazy. Thanks so much for watching. See y'all soon. Bye!